Hi everyone, in this short video I will show you how to transfer material from a source document into the template. Many chairs ask their students to work on only one chapter at a time or only one section at a time. In that case, once that chapter or section is finished, you can transfer it to the template. What I encourage you to do is prepare the chapter or the section before you bring material in, as I have shown here. Notice that I've inserted all of the level one headings for chapter one of this dissertation template. If you choose not to prepare the headings, then you can copy them in from the source, or you can type them in clean as body text and then tag them in the template document as I have done here. So first of all, before you get started, make sure when you're doing formatting work to turn on the Pilcro in both the template document and the source document. Notice that in the source document the margins are one inch all around, which is standard for a Word document. In the template document that left margin is 1.5 inches, and that needs to stay that way. That allows for possible binding of the manuscript after it's finished. So let's go to the source document. We have the Pilcro turned on. Copy only one section at a time in between headings. That's the safest way to go. If you copy an entire chapter, then you increase the risk of bringing in corrupting formatting into the template, and you don't want to do that. This takes a little more time, but it's the safest way to go. So copy from the very first letter all the way down to the final period of this section. Do not include that last little formatting marker. Control C to copy. And then I've inserted some placeholder text in the template document in anticipation of receipt of this material. So I will copy text over text, first letter to final period, and control V to paste. Then it's important to go back up and check to make sure that each paragraph is tagged as body text. Open up the styles menu as I showed you in the other video and then check to see that this is body text. Normal can be okay, but sometimes it can be wrong. There can be additional spacing in between paragraphs. So I encourage you to highlight the paragraph and tag it as body text. That body text tag will ensure the one half inch indent at the, on the first line and it will also make sure that line spacing is double with no points before or after in between sentences and also in between paragraphs. You can do one paragraph at a time, or you can highlight the entire section that you just brought in and tag it as body text. I'm doing one at a time. And again, this is to make sure that the formatting is correct for each paragraph that you just brought in. Now the final paragraph should be body text because we did not copy that marker in the source text. So you've double checked, everything is body text, the spacing looks good, and you can proceed to the next section.